that all your WhatsApp status, all the WhatsApp status you check out, the pictures and videos on uh, everybody's WhatsApp status you check out, is saved to your device uh, locally. I don't know if this is temporary or permanently saved, but uh, I'm going to show you how to delete uh, WhatsApp status or find WhatsApp status you've checked out um, with your device. And it, you can also delete them. It will help you save, um, you know, memory. Okay, so this is my memory card where my WhatsApp uh, folder is backed up and all. Okay, so this is where my backups are. This is where my databases are. And this is where my media is. Go to media, then status. You see this, this folder is... Uh, slightly transparent because it's a hidden folder so you cannot see it with uh, your normal file manager unless you show hidden files or hidden folders okay so uh, let's just assume you are using a different file manager that's uh, ES file explorer by the way so this is my default file manager on Android and click on this option key hide hidden files or show hidden files make sure you show hidden files so that you'll be able to find this particular folder so we're going to go to status then you will see all the whatsapp status you've checked out people's whatsapp status they are all being saved to your device um the whole thing takes up too much memory too much space this is someone's video can you imagine that i checked out okay so <clears throat> basically to delete these uh whatsapp status you should just mark them all because if you leave them they will, they will keep coming as you keep checking uh you know people's status and you'll be wondering what's taking up space on your phone things like this take up too much space on your device so i'm going to delete these ones um everything is 12.81 mb and voila okay so what happens now that we've deleted these status what's what's going to happen does that mean the status has been deleted on on whatsapp as well no not really not really this is what happens you have to load what, what whatsapp does is it loads all the status locally so you can check people's status if i've seen this person's status now this particular status uh still loading this as it's loading like this is actually saving locally to my device so i can always come back to view the status without having to load it again i'm going to press the back button once see i didn't have to load it again this one that loaded i didn't have to load it again as well it's new ones that you know load up so that's basically how it works as they are loading they're actually saving to your device and you can delete them once you delete them the thing is you have to come back to load them load the ones you'd like to see right but just just don't forget from time to time try as much as possible to clear out whatsapp status and if you need somebody's whatsapp status maybe you're the type that steals people's status on whatsapp you can find people's whatsapp these, these are the two we loaded so far okay um that's that on how to steal people's status and you know delete status as well so uh be sure to check out my other tutorials you know um there was a previous tutorial i made on how to disable you know uc browser uh uc browsers push notifications and be sure to subscribe to this channel for you know cool updates and more awesome stuff be awesome